Hello and welcome to the Infinite Spellbook. In this series, a random spell from the artifact known as the Infinite Spellbook will be chosen and shown to you, starting with a brief excerpt before explaining its origin, how to cast it, and the effects of the spell once cast. Some of these spells may be a simple utility that causes minor effects whilst others can shake the very foundations of reality. Some of these spells that will be presented may have definable origins, and the creators will be mentioned as such, all rights in regards to the spell belonging to them. Other spells may have no clear origin, such is the nature of the Infinite Spellbook. Let us open another page and see what spell is contained within. Our first cantrip has finally appeared, and one that offers a great utility for a price. Let us look at Equilibrium from the Elder Scrolls series. Equilibrium is a spell of dark balance, a perilous weave of magic that bridges the chasm between vitality and arcane power. When invoked, the caster feels a cold, eerie energy pulse through their veins, a sensation both unsettling and invigorating. As the spell takes hold, a spectral light begins to emanate from the caster's hands, an ethereal glow that pulses with an unsettling rhythm. The light is a deep, haunting red, tinged with shadows that seem to coil and writhe like living entities. The air around the caster grows heavy, as if the very essence of life is being drawn into the spell's hungry grasp. With each beat of the caster's heart, they can feel their life force being siphoned away, funneled through their hands and converted into raw magic. The process is not without pain. A sharp, gnawing ache spreads through their chest, growing in intensity with every moment the spell remains active. It is as if, though, their very soul is being drained, torn apart to fuel the arcane power they now wield. Despite the pain, there is a heavy rush of power that comes with the sacrifice. As health is depleted, raw magic surges in its place, filling the caster with a near limitless reservoir of magical energy. The world around them seems to sharpen, colours more vivid and sounds more acute, as their senses heighten under the strain of the spell. But this power comes at a cost. The caster must carefully walk the line between empowerment and oblivion, for to push the spell too far is to risk death itself. Equilibrium is not a spell for the faint of heart, it demands a willingness to embrace pain, to sacrifice one's own life essence in the pursuit of greater magical might. As the caster releases the spell, the spectral light fades and the gnawing pain subsides. They are left drained, yet empowered, a stark reminder of the thin line between life and death and the dangerous allure of power that lies in the balance. Equilibrium is a spell of sacrifice, a testament to the lengths one may go to in pursuit of arcane mastery. Equilibrium has no clear origin, but it first appeared in Skyrim, within a tome inside the Labyrinthian, an ancient Nordic ruin. This possible connection may mean that the spell was created by the Dragon Cult during the Merithic Era, the earliest point of history after the Dawn Era. Since it is impossible to know for sure, the origin of the spell will forever remain a mystery, though the spell itself has endured for centuries. The function of Equilibrium is simple, in that it generates magicka at the expense of vitality. Within the world of the Elder Scrolls, magicka is the energy that fuels all magic in the world similar to the Weave. The spell is highly effective, able to convert health to magicka in a second. If the caster chooses, they can maintain for the spell as long as they can withstand, though if they are not careful, the spell can cost them their life. The Infinite Spellbook states that Equilibrium can be learned by the Order of the Profane Soul Bloodhunters, Sorcerers and Wizards. Though it is risky, the advantage of having extra magical power may make the sacrifice worth it. Now, let's look at the spell as it appears within the Infinite Spellbook. Equilibrium is a cantrip, with a casting time of one minute. It has a range of self and only requires verbal and somatic components. Its effects are instantaneous, and it belongs to the Transmutation School of Magic. By sacrificing your very life force, you can convert it into magic. You lose 10 hit points, which cannot be negated in any way when you begin to cast this spell. 
And once the spell has been successfully cast, meaning after the minute of casting is complete, you regain one expended first level spell slot. If you do not have an expended spell slot available, or do not finish casting the spell, the spell fails and the hit points are lost. When you begin to cast this spell, you can choose to expend additional hit points, each additional 10 hit points expended, increasing the level of the spell slot recovered by one level. This means you can regain a 4th level spell slot by sacrificing 40 hit points. To be clear, you cannot regain 4 first level spell slots at once by expending 40 hit points. The only way that can happen is if you spend the time to cast this spell multiple times. Equilibrium may be risky to use, but sometimes that extra bit of magic can be the difference between victory or defeat. But with that, we've reached the end of today's video. Before you head off, I would like to thank you for watching, and I hope you managed to get something out of this. The Equilibrium spell is available on D&D Beyond for free, and the link to it is in the description. I hope you all have a great day, and may your dice roll favourably. Goodbye for now.